video series on the DIY. We're building a food truck in a trailer form right in your driveway. So let's come right in, get the first glimpse at this empty trailer that's gonna be a mobile kitchen on wheels. So now we move into the, uh, into the inside. Yesterday we talked a little bit about the outside. Frank Balls here is here with Rolling Burritos Food Truck. And I'm gonna measure, I need a measurement right now. So right now I'm looking for a measurement to order the concession window, which uh, when I did my first trailer, which is Rolling Burritos Food Truck, it was an empty trailer just like this, an empty shell, which now it's a full kitchen on wheels. And what I'm looking for is the measurement for the concession window, because I need to order it. I ordered it from this place in Ohio called uh, JR Aluminum. But when I measure it here, one of the important things to know about a concession trailer or utility trailer and clothes trailer is uh, the width between the studs, the closer they are together, like this one's 16 inches, they call it 16 inches on center. The closer they're together, the more structurally um, sound, right? The, the better construction that it has. Because there's some that are 24, that means that every 24 inches, you're gonna have one of these, they call it studs, right here where you see these screws on the plywood. But what I need, I'm gonna start a little demo right here. Don't worry, I've done this before. What I need, if you look in here closer, when I take this off, eventually we're going to take all this off. We're going to take all this off on the trailer. But right here, this is what I learned when I did the first rolling burritos food truck, is I need the space, if you see these studs right in here, if you can see them, that's what holds your plywood together and that's what holds the walls of the of the trailer and right here is where we need to cut our window which is called the concession window where you're going to open it up serve your money take the money serve the whatever you're going to do coffee burritos uh tacos nachos you name it you can do, literally do anything because at the end of the day we're going to sell this one and uh, i need the measurement because the one that i currently have is 78 inches so if i go here so i'm going to go from right here because we want to measure so they call this a rough opening. A rough opening is what the whole size is gonna be. So I go, if I go from right there to this last one, I have 61 and a half inches. And that's actually smaller than the one I currently have right now. So I need to find where this other, which is right there. Exactly right there. And if I go there, that's 77 and a half inches. So there's a stud right in here where this meets, right there. Cut it out for you guys so you guys can see it. If you guys see there's a stud right there. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna take this measurement from right there. And then you're gonna take it all the way across to this one. Where this one ends, it's 77 and a half inches. So that's where our rough opening is gonna be. Tomorrow, we're gonna order this from JR Aluminum. 77 and a half inches is the width, and the height, I think we're gonna order exactly like the other one, which is 33 inches. So it's gonna be right there. So that is what our concession window is gonna be. That is the next step when you come inside. You need to order a lot of these parts because they take like a week sometimes to, uh, to uh, get ready. And that's part of the concession window. So 77 and a half inches, and then we're gonna go 33 high, and then we're gonna cut a big hole right here, and then it's gonna be all open. So with that, Frank Waltz here is Rolling Burritos Food Truck. We're building out a food truck in the driveway, and I believe that if you get a little bit of DIY knowledge, you can build it yourself as well, or you can just buy this one when it's ready. So Frank Waltz here is, let's go order this window.